what happens if you don't get three hundred thousand for the house? Well, I this this free and paid for. I don't care. I won't sell it. So they ain't motivated. You know what to do. Put them in a the follow up and keep it moving. They ain't okay, got no motivation. See, that's why we have to ask the right question. Not saying to move along right there, but I'm just saying this is the mindset. We're asking these questions to see what these people are thinking. What happens if you don't get the three hundred thousand dollars that you want for your house, Mister Seller? I may take about ten or fifteen less, but nothing under two eighty five. But what happens if you don't get that number? You see, that's a tough question. Sometimes it is. Sometimes they'll tell you, hey, yeah, I'll let the bank have it. Or right. I'll just give it to my wife. Or I'll just, whatever I do, I'll rent it out. Right, see, right. They, they're going to tell you by their answer to the question what you're going to do to close them. Hey, Chris, is